Hi everyone, Dave here. I wanted to say something about a lot of things that I'm seeing on Twitter um, where churches are kind of patting themselves on the back saying how good their access is because they've got a lift, they've got a ramp, they've got level access. It's about far more than that. We can't keep telling people that we are inclusive unless we get the other stuff right. And the other stuff includes things like good lighting, a good sound system with a working loop, good signage, good lighting, liturgies that aren't using language which is too complex for people to understand. Welcome, get your welcome right for disabled people and you'll be getting it right for everyone. Get your welcome right and disabled people will forgive you some of the practical problems that are around physical access. Many disabled people have suffered badly in churches where the teaching has been wrong, where the teaching has said things like disabled people are disabled because of their sin. And don't tell me that it doesn't happen anymore, it happens a lot. Disabled people are told that they're simply not praying hard enough for a cure. These kind of things can put disabled people off church forever. They're really damaging. It's a form of abuse that we need to take very seriously. So we cannot keep patting ourselves on the back because we've got a ramp and a lift and level access. That isn't it. It's about making everyone welcome. So please, can we have a rethink? Can we stop being so self congratulatory but I can't even say the word. You know what I mean. Self-congratulatory, there it is. And give disabled people a decent welcome. Personally, my profession is as an access auditor. And that means that I can go into buildings and make judgments about what changes need to be made for physical access for disabled people. When I go as a worshipper, I'm not going with my access auditor's head on, I'm going just to worship. But if somehow I may feel unwelcome because of my disability, then I switch heads and I become access auditor and I start making a list and ticking off that list the things that I think are doing the church is doing wrong. And I don't think I'm, I don't think that's just because I'm an access auditor. I think that's what disabled people do. By and large, I think what we do is we go in and if we're made welcome, even if there are some issues, if the welcome is strong enough and good enough, we will forgive you the issues. But when we're made to feel unwelcome because our disability actually makes someone feel uncomfortable, that isn't the disabled person's problem, that's the other person's problem. And that those attitudes need to be dealt with and we need teaching on that, and we, ha we cannot call ourselves inclusive until we solve these issues. We are here to help. We'll come to your church, we'll talk about it, we could even maybe run you a short course or something. But please let us not keep talking about how wonderful we are at access until we've addressed this. We're here to help. Get in touch if you need that help. Thanks.